is a favorite spot for male cheetah to scent mark. And the dung is a very important meant for scent marking. Now, cheetah, one of the most fascinating things for me about cheetah is that they are the only one of the big cats that needs a male dominant ratio for breeding. So what I mean by that is that if we look, there will always there will be a one male leopard. We'll have multiple females. So there's always more females than males. With cheetah, females need more males than females. Oh, look at that. He's getting up. Having a sniff. Come north, come north, come north. Take the great north road, Mr. Cheetah. No, 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 no. Bad car. Bad car. Good car. Good car. <laughs> Yay! No car. So it looks like they're quite full. And so, as I was saying before that cheetah rudely interrupted me by standing up, is that... Actually, let's try... A bit better. Uh, is that... Female cheetah will often turn down multiple males, up to three or four, before they're mate. So it's the only animal. Oh, look at that. Look how streamlined and sleek it is. Built for speed. So if you hear a little spray, it's just me putting some sun cream on. Aqua's wondering whether these cheetah are habituated. Uh, as you can see from our neighbors to the south, very habituated. Those vehicles were very close to the cheetah. Strange enough, this is the same two male cheetah that occasionally come onto Juma, and that Brian and I were lucky enough to see being chased by the quarantine male leopard. Uh, we've seen them a few times, not very often but it looks like they're going to listen. So obviously all your positive thoughts that you were pumping into the cheetah's brain has told it it should come towards us. Now, let's hope it does, oh no, it doesn't get confused and, and go the wrong way. We want 